Hey, what's up? This is Kaylee, and I'm here today with a special guest. Uh, he's a superintendent for Montgomery County School System, and um, I'm going to be asking him some questions. Good morning. Good morning. Um, what does a superintendent do? Uh, my job is, is, is basically managing people. It's my job to make sure that uh, we have the teachers that we need, that we have uh, all the staff members that we need, uh, to make sure that the schools can run smoothly. Okay. Um, how do you get to be a superintendent? Uh, most of the time, uh, uh, most people start out as, as teachers, and I was a teacher, um, and, and then they move into administration and become uh, uh, assistant principals, principals, central office administrators, um, uh, and, and ultimately along there you're getting a lot of education as well. Uh, um, uh, I got my uh, uh, degree was in uh, uh, social studies secondary education, so I was a, a, a secondary uh, a social studies teacher. Uh, then I got a master's in business administration and ultimately my doctorate in education. So it, it takes a lot of work, it takes a, a, lot of, uh, a lot of perseverance, but I wouldn't trade it for anything in the world. Okay. Um, where do you go to school to become a superintendent? Uh, I went to, uh, to to get my bachelor's degree at Appalachian State. I got my master's degree at Gardner Webb, and I got my uh, my, my doctoral degree uh, also at Appalachian State. So I, I did a, the most of my training uh, in the western part of the state. But you can get those degrees anywhere. Um, what would you like everyone to know about the Montgomery school systems? Uh, we we have a we have an excellent school system here. Um, all of our schools are really good. They're, they're led by you know, principals that are very passionate about education. Uh, we have wonderful teachers. I, I have often said that the best part of Montgomery County is, is the people. The people here are wonderful. Uh, we have great teachers. Uh, our, our, we got great kids. Uh, and I know I was talking with Mr. Williamson before we, before we started the interview today. A lot of people, I don't think, realize how lucky we are to be in Montgomery County and what a, what a great opportunity we have by living here. So, uh, I, I just, I, I love everything about it. Um, what is the biggest challenge ed educators face in the school systems today? Uh, the biggest challenge uh, that we face, uh, you know, we, we're like everybody else, uh, budgetary issues, uh, you know, having, having the funds that you need. Uh, over time, everything always gets more and more expensive. Uh, but having, having the funds that we need so that we're, we're giving you the classes that you want to take, that you become interested in, uh, and ultimately, you know, due to that lack of funding, we do have a teacher shortage now. It's hard to find the teachers that we need uh, to, to, to staff our classrooms. Uh, so really, the, the teacher shortage and having the funds that we need is, is the biggest challenge that we face today. Um, what advice would you give someone who's interested in becoming a superintendent? Uh, just, uh, just always apply yourself. Uh, take, take, the, take your studies very, very seriously. Uh, you know, I'll be the first to tell you, and, and if you were to talk to some of my teachers in high school, uh, you know, I was sometimes the class clown and that kind of things, and I didn't always, I didn't always take things as, as seriously as it needed to be, and that kind of caught up with me when I got to college. Uh, I realized that everything wasn't always fun and games, and that, you know, at a certain point you have to work very, very hard uh, if you're going to accomplish a lot in life. Uh, but I would, I would tell anybody, go into education. It is a wide open field. Uh, there's always going to be jobs for teachers, and, and, and it's, it's a way to make a good living. And then ultimately, uh, if, you, if you like it and you feel that you're good at it, I would encourage anybody to go into administration and to seek out a job as a superintendent. Uh, it's a very rewarding career, and it's, it's, it's one that, uh, you know, when you get up every day and you're working and, and you're, you live your life to try to help students, uh, you're, you're, you're doing something good for society, and I really enjoy that. Um. This has been What's Up West Middle. Thank you to my guest, Dr. Ellis. Plus, stay tuned for to this channel.